We operate two unique venues in Glasgow's West End, Cotiers and Webster's. Each of the two sites provides a striking and beautiful theatre and event space, complemented by bar and restaurant operations, which can hold their own in a very competitive environment. As has been wi widely reported, lockdown has had a serious impact on our sector. Everything came to halt right at the start of our spring and summer season. And we were on track to have one of the best seasons on record with a full arts programme and strong bookings, both our venues. Having brought both of these A-listed buildings, precious parts of our built heritage, into active use, our objective has been to run a varied arts programme from each of the venues, as well as maximising use of the upper hall at Webster's for community events, using the income stream from our bar and restaurant operations to support all of that. Despite the lockdown, our core objectives have not really changed, but opportunities have emerged that we previously didn't consider pursuing. For example, like many food and drink outlets, pickup and home delivery services have been provided from courtiers using electronic booking systems and with the ability to reopen outside areas. In July, we have used our restaurant diary booking systems to ensure that tracking and tracing will be possible. We have taken the opportunity to make and plan significant physical changes within our buildings, creating more space and circulation routes that will work better in the context of social distancing and improve the operation in the longer term as well. Both venues offer attractive and spacious outdoor bar areas, which are in high demand at the moment, and there is no other comparable space in Glasgow's West End. And we've certainly benefited from the various support schemes, both grants and loans, during this time, as well as the concessions and VAT payments and rates these measures have been a lifeline to help support our employees and our businesses. I think it's too soon to say how our operations will change in the long term as a consequence, but we're hopeful that these changes will increase turnover and business performance as long as our customers return and respond. In the short term, it seems likely that people, including regular customers, will remain cautious about frequenting bars and restaurants. As a result, we're transitioning into using our performance spaces with their high ceilings, good ventilation, as alternatives to bar and restaurant rooms within which to provide table service for food and drink. These large spaces are very atmospheric and actually we think the very special nature of these venues compared with the conventional bar and restaurant offer will put us in a strong position to make the most of increasing customer confidence over the coming weeks. Our flexible venue space means we can consider different approaches in the context of arts. We are hoping to reintroduce live performances within these distinctive spaces with cabaret seating instead of rows of seats as soon as we are able to and permitted to do so. Conventional style theatres with fixed seating are very constrained as regard the options for social distancing. Thanks to the flexibility of our venues, we are in a much better position to be more creative in our approach and to achieve the same level of protection without the dead space and loss of atmosphere associated with empty seats in rows. And so if these ideas prove popular with the visiting public, they may become regular features of what we have to offer. In addition, Cottiers and Websters also contain a number of smaller sized rooms that can be adapted for private hire for friends and family to enjoy catering for meals and events and to do so safely and within the COVID-19 guidelines.